Um, so this is Seren. Seren is a four-year-old um, mare owned by the Lachlan Stud. She's out of a lovely little pony, Galena, um, who's a synod pony. Um, and she has bred some really top class sports ponies, including this one. So this one is by Super Champ um, and was bred by Lynn Crowden, but born at Lachlan Stud. Um, and she has been there since the day she was born. Um, so about a month ago, we went and picked up Seren to bring her here to start work under saddle. Um, and we've really just given her loads and loads of time to settle. Um, she really has had quite a sheltered life, but a lovely life at the stud. Um, there's really, there's never been any bad um, experiences for her. She's gotten to live life as a horse in the in their herd um, in the lovely past. Um, the lovely paddocks up in Creef, so um, it's been quite a change for her moving to KA. Okay, so as you can imagine, a horse that has never left the stud, can you imagine bringing her out the field and loading her into a trailer for the very first time? So um, we obviously anticipated that, that might be an issue, and we didn't want it to make the whole process as stress-free and as little of a worry for her as possible. Um, so a couple of days before we were planning to pick her up, we took a trip out to the stud, we took the trailer along with us, um, and we gave her an opportunity to, to see the, uh, the trailer, have a sniff of the ramp, and put her feet on the ramp, and eventually she followed her friend right through the box. Um, and it was really quite, quite okay. So a couple of days later we went and picked her up, and it really took very little time at all for her to walk on the box. So she came here, and it was a bit, it's a short journey, but it's a bit of a wiggly journey. Um, so when she arrived, she was a bit kind of, a bit unsettled, where you now? Um, but luckily we have two of her stud sisters here um, on the yard already so I think that helped ease her and get her just a little bit more settled a little bit more quickly. and loads of time to settle. So she's been here, let's say, about a month and we really haven't pushed it at all. We've let her guide us in terms of what she's ready to do and when. And um, What was really important is that we established a, a consistent routine for her right from the start so that she knew what to expect um, and what was likely to come up in her day. Um, so really to begin with, it was just coming in from the field, um, getting used to her stable, um, having a feed and getting a, a groom all over, um, which she's adapted to really quite nicely. And only, only in the last couple of weeks have we started to introduce things like um, wearing a bridle for the first time, um, which she took to really easily. And as you can see, she's also got her saddle on as well. So she's only had that on a few times so far. I'm on a stool, because I'm not actually that tall. Um, but what we're doing is we're just getting her used to me sort of elevating myself a wee bit and just placing weight across her saddle. We're not doing any more than that at, at the moment, but I just don't want her to think of this as an issue at all. Obviously we're looking to, to go ahead and back her, um, but we'll be doing that with, with zero time pressure from the stud, which is lovely. So we'll just go at her pace and make sure she's totally comfortable at any given time. 